There is the dead and there is the dead in Christ. The dead will be judged, but the dead in Christ will rise first to be with him forever in his holy presence, rejoicing in his holy presence. St. Paul in his epistle to the Romans says the wage of sin is death. Correct? The wage of sin is death. Now, these are the dead, meaning these are the people that rejected Jesus Christ. The nation were angry. The nations were angry because Jesus reigned. So these people chose to live in sin. These people chose to live in darkness. The wages of sin is death. So these are dead in their sins. This, what you call a dead person, truly dead. When they are living in sin, the unrepentant soul is a truly dead person. Why? Because when Adam broke God's word in the Garden of Eden, something happened. There is two kinds of deaths. There is the biological, physical death, and there is the spiritual death. The biological, spir uh, physical death is when the spirit departs from the body, separates from the body. This is called a biological, physical death, when the spirit leaves the body. But there is one death that is forever. This one is temporal. When the spirit leaves the body is a temporal death. But when the spirit leaves the creator, that's when that person is truly dead. When the spirit separates from the creator, from God himself. When we sin, our spirit separates from God. This is the true death. To this kind of a person you call a dead person. But those, according to St. Paul, 1 Thessalonians 4.16, they are dead in Christ. Everyone who is dead in Christ is living. Everyone who is dead because of sin cannot live. 